Always teach and just get your legs back, right? Just get your legs back. But what we want to do is we actually want to sprawl and circle away from the leg he's attacking. So the first drill that we'll do, okay, guys, just that reach-in drill, okay? So if he's doing it, all I'm going to do, okay, is just nice and slow. I'm going to reach in like a high, high crotch. He's going to be circling and sprawling away, okay? So here I just reach. He's sprawling, okay? I'm gonna, uh, it's not fast, okay? It's getting him to uh, recognize the step and where he needs to circle, okay? So again, if I go uh, single leg, okay? He's gonna be taking that leg, he's gonna be sprawling it away. So here, boom. What we wanna do is we just wanna create an angle for reattacks, okay? Where if he just sprawls straight back, yeah, without a doubt, he's gonna get his legs back, he's gonna defend, but most of the time he's gonna step, get stuck in a front headlock, his elbows are going to get caught, so we've just kind of taken this new philosophy of chasing ankles, chasing angles, and getting right to our re-attacks. So guys, go ahead, all right, about 30 seconds, one guy, all right, high crotch, single leg, make sure you guys are strong and circling, okay? Go ahead and go. Some of the best times to score points are off of re-attacks, you know, and so we really, really try to push that. There's always, there's always ways to score. Score. And a lot of times when you're wrestling high-level opponents, it's tough to get them out of position. 